this is a Dell Precision M4600. And what we're gonna do today is we're gonna upgrade the memory in it. And so the first thing you wanna do is pull the battery out. And it's pretty simple on this one. You've got a little clip over here, a little slide thing, and then you just pull it up. So that is out. Next thing we're gonna do is there are two screws here that we have to undo. I'm just gonna use my old knife here. I'm gonna take these two screws out. This one's got some damage on the corner, so this panel sticks a little bit. We're going to be addressing that damage in a future video. And then just slide it off. So you've got two slots right here. And so these two are going to be the ones. Let's see, are these the ones we're going to replace? Yes, these are the ones we're going to replace. But this laptop has four sticks of RAM. And so what I'm going to show you is the other two slots as well. So in case you were upgrading all four or you had to upgrade the other two, uh, the other two I will show you. We're going to flip the laptop over. We're going to open it up. readjust the camera here so what you're gonna to need to do is tilt the screen back and this trim piece here is gonna to have to come off so you can just get at the corner and just kind of start lifting up and get on each corner you might have to get a little bit of help with something in here. Plastic, plastic little bar would be best, but uh, I'm mistaken. It comes up here. Well, some of them have a thing where you take this piece off and then this one actually has a bezel around the keyboard that comes off. So we're gonna take that off. part up here does not have to come off. I've never had one of these apart before. And you just kind of pop it loose. So it looks like you've got one, two, three screws. So we're going to come in here and take these three screws out. One. Keep these separate from the bottom because they are different from those two screws we took out of the bottom. And then the keyboard should lift up. Oh, I missed one. There's one right here. So there's four screws. Kind of snaps on the sides. And then kind of pull it out. So what we can do is kind of just lay it over, or just kind of stick it up like that, and then you don't have to undo it, just don't pull on it tightly. And you've got two sticks of RAM under here, so 
Um, if you know, you could pop these two out if you need to replace those. So I'm replacing the ones on the bottom. So for right now, to make this video go quick, we are gonna just set this back together like that. Of course, you, if you were replacing those two sticks of rams, you would just pop them out and replace those. But for this one, we are doing these two already took the old ones out so we're gonna put the new ones in these are four gig sticks so that'll give this machine 16 gigs of RAM that's it quick and easy what you do is um, go ahead and you know slip that cover back on put these two screws back in and then you would need to put the battery back in. Of course, on the other side, I'd need to put the four keyboard screws back in and snap this cover back on. It just pushes in and snaps. Pushes on and snaps. And that's it. So, thanks for watching. Leave a comment down below. Hit the like button and subscribe for more.